Remington Bauer of Edison, you have quite the story, not being even in the lineup the past two years, and then coming out and winning a district title to get to the state tournament. What changed for you? Uh, nothing for me, really. Um, just putting working in the room. I got great drill partners. I think we got one of the best rooms to practice in in the state. You know, those guys really helped me a lot. Um, after taking a year off, I just went freshman year, so they really helped me get back to it. Yeah, you guys made school history in the amount of guys that you brought to this tournament. So tell me, what is that Edison wrestling environment like? It's really nice, you know. We got a ton of support in the community. Um, a ton of alumni come back and help us. It hasn't been the same this year with COVID, but typically we got a lot of college guys that come back and wrestle with us. You know, we might not always be the best wrestler, but Davey's always got us in shape. And I know you guys have been hungry for that team title, and it's been a battle between you guys and Legacy Christian. Is what everyone is saying here so how badly do you guys want to defeat them for that you know it's it's more about the title for us we know legacy's there we know it's going to be mostly a two horse race but we gotta go out and take care of what we need to do not just worry about them well you already took care of business a little bit just moments ago you won your first state match tell me how you were feeling during that one um to be honest it felt a little sloppy but i think that's just the first match years and Got a big one coming up, so I think uh, be ready to go. Be ready to go with that. So I know your dad also used to coach Logan Stever. What was it like growing up and seeing that caliber of wrestling and learning from your dad, who's coached some of the best? Um, it was really nice. I mean, every day after school, I'd go down to the wrestling room and I watched not only Logan Stever but four of the best guys in the country go at it every day. And I wish I would have been just a little bit older so that I could appreciate what they did in that room a lot more than I did at that age. But, you know, I'm just really lucky that I was exposed to that at a young age. Absolutely. Well, best of luck to you, Remington, as you finish your remaining bouts here at your first ever state tournament.